The Mandalorian. Wad time. This week is going to be a Star Wars theme week. And uh, so with that, um, you've got some small ones around the house. Maybe this will motivate them to want to jump in. And uh, that we're doing these Star Wars scene workouts. Now, this is our equipment version. Our equipment, you're going to need a dumbbell. You're going to need your skip rope, your timer. It is a 12 minute AMRAP. So that means we are going to be working steady for 12 minutes. Get your drink and everything before you start. When it's time for the workout to start, put that off to the side. Stay focused on working 12 minutes nonstop. All right. So with that, we've got three movements. Uh, those three movements are going to be an alternating dumbbell snatch into an alternating V up into double unders. Can't do double unders. You'd be doing twice as many reps in single unders or line hops. So with that, we'll go in through the, those movements. So a dumbbell snatch. We're grabbing our dumbbell from between our leg and we're getting it overhead in one motion. So a snatch means there's no pause at the shoulder, okay? And we can switch that up in the air, and we're doing 10 of those. Not a lot of reps. Stay focused on breathing here. Make sure you're breathing as you're doing those reps. When we're doing that, keep a good back position, right? Good neutral spine. Don't round it, and don't stand like this, because as we're going fast and not a lot of reps, people can do that sort of thing, but I promise you, you'll have a sore back tomorrow if we do that. So let's try to focus on a good motion there. And even better, try to keep that as tight to the body as we can. Use those legs to drive that weight. After we're done that, we're down to ground, and we're doing our 20 alternating V-ups. So with that, arms behind head, and we're snapping those up. Okay? If that's too much for you, you can bend that knee. Okay? And that should make that a little easier for you. For some of you that have some hurting issues in that, this would be a great time to do alternating single leg glute bridges if we need to make that change up, okay? So that would be first our 10 alternating reps, then we move into our 20 alternating V-ups. After that, we're grabbing our skipping rope and we'd be working into our 60 double unders. If we're not doing double unders, we've got our skipping rope, and we're single unders. Be 120 reps. If you don't have the skipping rope, get the tape down. One, two, three, four, five. 120 of those, okay? So every time you go across the line, that's one rep. So got my breath up that quick already. So you can see it's gonna get your heart rate up pretty quick. Keep breathing as best you can while you're doing those movements. I'm thinking in 12 minutes, we should see a lot of six plus rounds, five for sure. Double unders may slow some people down trying to get that 60 reps. It will definitely jack some heart rates. So your score is your total number of rounds completed. So please, when you're done, love those sweaty selfies and those big smiles after we're done. And again, no one's judging the score. Number one, you really help me, the coach, and the other coaches know that the workouts are appropriate and that when we're programming for classes going forward, kind of the times we need to set up if we're working with some of these different workouts. So please, you're doing us a favor as much as anything. It is not a comparison and a score of a win or a lose on this.